Hey girl, period. If you're new here, my name is Misa Lorraine. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a post from me. In today's video, I will be doing this look right here. So if you are interested, please keep watching. Getting right into the video, I started by applying my concealer all over my brows and the concealer I'm using is the Juvia's Place Concealer in the shade 15. And then I'm going to go in with my Makeup Revolution Banana Powder to seal in the concealer so that it won't move and be wet on my brows and I'm just going to continue that process until I like the way it looks. Then I started to shape my brows using the Maybelline Superstay Foundation in the shade 330 Toffee Caramel and blended it out. Choose your fighter. Lightning in fire. Fight. Fight. I was so scared doing this because I didn't know how it would come out, but I did the other one off camera. And now I'm just tying my hair up because I'm not trying to get nothing on this hair. I'm using my Too Faced Hangover Primer to prime my face and to get ready to apply my foundation, which will be the same foundation I use to shape my brows. I spread out the foundation so that when I go in with my beauty blender, it's seamless and not too patchy. Before, I would just go over all the dots on my face and I would have to put more products because the bl the beauty blender, sorry, would like soak up all the product and I would have to put like way more than I use. But now I just use less and it looks even better. And if you haven't watched my updated makeup tutorial for this year, pause this video and go watch that because I'm not doing anything too different other than a couple of things. Fight. 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 Now I'm going in with my e.l.f. Camo Concealer in the shade of Fair. I forgot the shade name, but it will be in the description box. And I'm only using this concealer underneath my eyes. And then I'm going in with another shade. It's the same e.l.f. concealer, but it's another shade. And I'm just going to um, put that on my nose, my upper lip, and on my chin. And now I'm blending that out with my damp beauty blender. And now I'm going to be setting all that concealer with my Beauty Bakery setting powder in the color Cassava. 
and then I will be brushing all the powder away with a fluffy face brush. I'm using the MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in the shade Medium Deep to contour my cheekbones and my nose. And I didn't cream contour for this look because I didn't want it super heavy. Um, I wanted the brows and the eyes and the blush to really seal the look. blush I'm using is NARS Angelica. I'm setting my face with this Cucumber and Rose Water Organic Toner Mist from a brand called Refresh and you could get it at Ulta. And then I'm highlighting with my favorite Maybelline highlighter in the shade Molten Gold. And for the eyes, I can't give you guys the name for the eyeshadow I'm using because it's like this no-name eyeshadow palette with a bunch of brown shades. I forgot where I got it from, but if you want to try this look, just go in with a really muted brown shade for the eyeshadow like this one. I'm gonna be applying my NYX matte eyeliner and then put some mascara on to get them ready for my lashes. Then I'm gonna go in with the same NYX liquid liner from the Vivid Brights collection in the color Vivid Pu Vivid Petal. I was about to say Vivid Pupil. What the? <laughs> Lashes I'm using are from my local beauty supply store and I don't remember the name, but they are from KISS.
I'm using my NYX lip liner pencil in soft brown, but I have heavily melanated lips, so light colors like this don't really show up that well. So I will be going over it lightly with another NYX lip liner in the color Espresso and cleaning up the liner afterwards. Choose your fighter. This little boy, this little boy is going to make me child. I went to go open my lipstick and saw that it was on the top of my cap. Like this little boy is going to drive me up a wall. I'm telling you guys. But anyway, the lipstick I used was um, MAC Bosom Friends and then the lip gloss that I used was boho um lip gloss from morphe All right, girlies, so the look is complete. Comment down below if you would ever try blonde brows. All the products I use today will be linked in the description box as well as all my social media. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. Mwah. Keep on feeling, but you can't break my broken heart.